everyone, welcome back to my channel. So if you guys are new here, my name is Kristen and I am completely obsessed with The Sims here on my channel. So you guys, today's video it is for a little teeny tiny host build and I will try to do my best to remember to leave a link for the gallery download in the description below. And if I happen to possibly forget, you can definitely still find it in the gallery using my EA username Kristen Marie XO or the same hashtag. So if you guys do happen to download this host, just make sure that you guys do put on your move objects. It just makes sure that everything that I do place in the game does get placed the same into yours. Now, I kind of based this around a host that I had kind of played around with a little bit this past weekend on the live stream that I had did with The Sims 3. So it's kind of a random build, but it actually kind of took on its own like life of its own and it looks completely different. So I kind of knew that I wanted to do some kind of like a micro mini home because it's been a while since I have done like a compact build for a house. So the more I built it, the more it kind of took on, on its own like coloring. So I did end up using like the windows and doors that came with the new fitness game pack. And I think that's kind of um, where I based like a lot of the black and dark coloring from, from those. Now you guys, I love how this turned out. I kind of want to do an apartment that's like dark themed like this because I feel like a lot of my builds lately have been very, very light and dainty. Um, color themed if that makes sense. So I've done like a lot of pastels and a lot that are like white and gray. So I really enjoyed this one a lot and it definitely has like a clean modern feel and even if I wanted to add clutter to this you guys there <laughs> there's just no room for it anywhere. So this actually is only one bedroom and I was only able to put in like a twin size bed in the bedroom. So I mean, you might even possibly be able to fit in a double bed, but I feel like it wouldn't make sense because you would have to put it up against the wall and you wouldn't be able to use it as a like a real function functioning item. You would still only be able to use one sim. So I did put in the one twin size bed and I think the bedroom is really cute. The rug definitely matches the windows and I never even realized that even when I was like going through the pack. But yeah, so I love that and I did want to make sure there was lots of windows because it was kind of hard to put windows throughout the house because where it was such a small area with like the cupboards and the shower and everything like that. So there is surprisingly also a completely full bathroom. Now that's actually surprising to me because even when I'm doing like the smallest apartments in San Myshuno, sometimes I don't even have enough room to put in a sink into the bathroom. So this house is a micro mini home and I was still able to actually put in like the stand up shower, a bath or <laughs> a bathtub, a toilet and a sink and a mirror. So that worked out really well. And then the door is just out in the like long narrow hallway and then I almost you guys forgot to put in a fridge <laughs> I had did uh what build did I do before there was a build that I had put up on my channel before was it for a kitchen it might have been for a kitchen no it was actually an apartment that I did last week you guys, I forgot to put in a fridge and I almost did that in this build, but I do remember towards the end, so if you guys are watching wondering why there is no fridge, I do end up going back in and place it in. So I also wanted to kind of keep the outside area very, very limited, but I mean the inside of the house, I wasn't actually able to fit like a table and chairs. So I did put like the outside table and chairs and a picnic table. So you will be able to have company over for meals and have a place to sit for visitors. And I also put in a barbecue just to have like a little bit of like an outside area as well. So I kind of wanted to place this in the desert because I don't know, I feel like it just worked in that area. So if you guys do like how this build turned out, maybe you want to put it into your own game, make sure to give it a very very big thumbs up so that I know you guys did enjoy and also let me know in the comments what kind of other builds and themes would you guys like to see me try to recreate in the future and hopefully I get to see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!